Holy moly, if you have not seen this yet, Unreal Engine 4 just wrapped up their State of Unreal presentation at GDC 2018. Every year, you think this is unbelievable. This is the pinnacle of how real CG can get. And every year, it just gets more and more impressive. This year, again, we were not disappointed. Let's take a look at what they showed us. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Montoya. What can I say? First, let's take a look at some highlights and then talk about it. Uh, let's start off with Siren. Now, Siren is a real-time face and body capture transposed onto a digitized human. If I was walking past the computer you were sitting down and I was walking by, I would have thought that's a real person. It wouldn't even cross my mind that was CG. But this is where we stand. You know, once you're sitting down and you're looking at it, I would say they're about... 90, 95% there in about two or three years, I don't think you'll be able to tell a difference between uh, a digitized human, CG, and the real thing. That's how close we're getting. And uh, this is definitely a major, major step there. Let's take a look at Siren. Hello, I'm Siren, and I'm a digital human. I was created by an international team of artists and engineers who wanted to challenge our ideas of what a synthetic human could be. I've got state-of-the-art, real-time graphics and an unprecedented level of detail in my eyes, skin and hair. Cool, right? But I'm more than just a collection of fancy pixels. I'm actually being driven by a real human actress and her dynamic motion capture through Unreal Engine. So what are you waiting for? Come meet me at the Vicon booth and see for yourself. Yeah, that is impressive. Now, on to real-time ray tracing. This Star Wars clip might as well be live action. If you had told me this is live action, I would have accepted it as fact. But this is actual CG. Watch this. What's the story with all the elevators lately? I heard Kylo Ren destroyed the one over in D Sector. If you ask me... Who's ever in charge of this place should be transferred to a hawk. Uh, what? Man, all right. Andy Circus. Andy fucking Circus. Golem, Lord of the Rings, Planet of the Apes. One of the two white guys from Black Panther. Ironically enough, the other white guy was Martin Freeman, or as we all know him, Bilbo Baggins. You Star Citizen fans will no doubt be excited for Andy Circus, the evil and powerful Vandul Warlord. I'm assuming it'll be a Vandal Warlord in the yet to be announced Star Citizen. It's going to be so good. But check this out. Here he is on the left, his and digitized tomorrow. face. On the right, the alien face. And, and he's reciting a, a speech by Shakespeare called Tomorrow oh, and Tomorrow goodness. and Tomorrow. Roll it. Andy Pace. From day to day to the last syllable recorded time. <laughs> and all our yesterdays have lighted fools the way to dusty death. Out! Brief candle! <laughs> Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage and then is heard no more. <laughs> it is a tale told by an idiot full of sound and fury signifying nothing. Now, 
That is just so damn impressive. I am so excited to see where this technology takes us in the next year and the year after that. Gaming is never going to be, we always say this is as good as it's going to get. It's always getting better. This is so exciting, guys. Are you excited for this technology? Let me know below what you think. Thumbs up. Tell your friends about this video. I'll see you in the next one.